Hey everyone, Retro Girls UK back for a brand new video and today we are off out to Nuneaton as you might have seen from our CEX Purge video or Purge in the Collection um, series Lisa has been watching loads of movies so we're off out to go and um, after we trade them in if you would have seen a different video and Lisa is on the hunt for some Scooby Doo slash Warner Brothers um, Hanna Barbera and if he goes on Cartoon Network and Boomerang back in the day and I'm after Spongebob DVD so if you're new to this channel don't forget to hit that like button, don't forget to subscribe and most importantly don't forget to hit that, hit that notification bell to get all the latest updates. So what are we waiting for? Let's get into it. So we've just got to Nuneaton, so let's go around the charity shop and see if I can finally complete that Scooby Doo collection. Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Gotta build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me? Well then baby, have a taste All the highs and the lows no, you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you But I can't control the pain If you're sticking by my side Maybe we could be okay Okay, okay Maybe you could be the change I need today I promise that I've never felt this way I really hope that you Will choose to stay Through all the pain I know you told your friend You're not okay And tell me what's wrong And why you never said You felt that way Try to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey 
Anyone can save me And honestly I'm not really sure I want saving I like to be my own worst enemy There's no risk if you don't try at anything So I'ma just get by in everything See you in the next life Have to be a better me I don't think that my head's on straight Gotta flip it and grip it And go and get an x-ray What's wrong with me? I just feel way Pushing on my chest And it squeeze till I suffocate Better change my mindset Meditate It's pretty cool that I'm alive And have better days I could walk, see, hear I should celebrate Think I could change my mind Maybe elevate Living life Every day Late at night not okay, all I want, and I pray, all I need are some better days, yeah, all I need are some better days, cause all I want, and I pray, I believe in the better yeah. days. Kinda stuck between a rock and a hard place Do I work hard or live at my pace? You're only young once, yeah that's all great But I also want a future where I'm okay Living life is doing lots of cocaine Wait no, it's living with no shame Wait no, it's sleeping in on Sundays I guess it's different for each of us and that's okay Well I just wanna be happy How to get there, hmm, glad that you asked me I think it's different for everyone Some of us need work, others need fun Some of us need purpose to overcome But try to do what you love when it's said and done Cause there's so many differences in each of us Trust your gut, it can show you what you want Living life, every day, late at night Not okay, all I want, and I pray All I need, are some better days Yeah, all I need, are some better days Cause all I want, and I pray I believe in the better days Living life, every day Late at night, not okay, all I want, and I pray, all I need are some better days, yeah, all I need are some better days, cause all I want, and I pray, I believe in the better days.
Okay, so this is the last charity shop of the day. We've been doing good so far. We've got loads of good stuff. Scooby Doo's, rare Blu rays. So let's go inside and see if they've got anything. So we just went into the charity shop. It is called Moyton Hospice, wasn't it? Yeah. The normally upstairs is where all the kids' DVDs are, like kids' toys. But unfortunately, it was closed. So we just had a look downstairs, but it was all like random junk. Yeah, so now let's go to CX. And see. maybe that toy shop if it's open. Yeah, so let's go to CX for now. See if they've got any Scooby Doo's that I need for my collection. SpongeBob as well. Oh, you've twisted my arm then. Yeah. Let me see what Instagram I know you posted it. I don't know, to be honest. I think that's the only one that they've got. Oh, hang on. I've just found one that I don't own. Without, yeah, you don't have to get one of them. Without dropping them. Look. Did you get that? Oh, you should get one of them just in case you do have it. That one. one. This one. Any more? No, they've only got two coins in stock. Luckily, I don't have any of them. So I'm so happy with that. Some more Scooby Doo stuff for the collection. So what can we say? We outdid ourselves again today. Uh, we've got two bags of goodies. As you've probably seen um, from the title of the video, we've been Scooby Doo Haunting Cartoon Network, Boomerang, Looney Tunes, Looney Tunes, SpongeBob, but spoiler. 
Why is it when I want Spongebob, I can't find many Spongebobs? But when we're out hunting and we're not actually looking for Spongebob, we see them everywhere, but we just don't think to pick them up in the moment. But besides, besides that, we did pick up a few extras that we saw out and about that look kind of cool. We picked up some rare stuff too, so... So I start in this bag? I'll start in this one. Get the get the media out of the way first. Okay. Yeah. Michelle, yeah. come across that in the charity shop. It's not in English. You can't buy this at CEX on Blu-ray, the UK version. And I think in English, this is called Midnight in Paris. Something like that. Is that better? Yeah, yeah. Midnight in Paris. Something like that. Yeah. I've never heard of it or come across it before. It's Owen Wilson film, isn't it? Yeah, it's got Owen Wilson, Kathy Bates. Can I say something? When I did a Google lens, it says we didn't get a UK release of this. We paid one pound for three films. But the weird thing is, it's foreign on the cover. Midnight in Paris on the disc. I think it's German. Yeah. There you go. Part of the 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 three four pound. I don't know why these are slowing. I don't. Yeah. I don't know. I got excited. We picked up a Robin of Sherwood um, network DVD. Yes, you can buy the complete box set, but. I'm going to give the first two episodes a watch if I like it, I'm going to buy the complete box of it, but would you get rid of it or would you keep it if you want your network? Keep it. Okay, yeah, so that was sealed. And can I show this one? Oh, I spotted this one, Lisa was looking for a Scooby-Doo. Yeah, it is a Scooby-Doo video, partially, but I've uh, seen it in the corner. Oh, it was in some basket, um, as you might have seen on the video, I don't know if Lisa would call it, it some basket with like three, four stacks of DVDs high, and I've seen this film on the top, so this is cocktail at first i thought it was roadhouse and this this is starring tom cruise there's no uk release of this on blu-ray you can only get on dvd i think ebay is like 13 pounds something but what can you complain three four quid i'm gonna give this a watch and i, I reckon we'll like it because i do like a lot of tom cruise lisa's not the biggest tom cruise fan. No, I'm not. and god good job i did but i can see it again I managed to come across some Scooby Doo's that I don't own. I've got a list on my phone. Uh, I've made a list on my phone of the Scooby Doo's that I'm missing because I'm going for the complete set. UK releases. And one of them was, is Scooby Doo and the Legend of the Vampire. This uh, one actually stars the Hex Girl, which was also from A Witch's Ghost. Love uh, the Hex can I ask them a question? Right, Lisa's got the two Scooby Doo vans that is free to buy. She's got that one with the movies in and the What's New Scooby Doo. Do you think she should double dip? Because the vans are very delicate. You pull them out and it's a bit shaky so they could rip. Double dip and keep the movies on the shelf. Or do you think she should keep them in the vans because I think that's part of the van. I'm not 100% sure. I personally think she should have them on the shelf because the vans are such a pain and they're not going to stick on the shelf. What's your opinion, Lisa? I don't know. I, the I, just, I, just, I just want everything. Like, you, know, you know what I'm saying? Like that. I mean, I've got some of them. Is this on HB, by the way? If it's not obvious enough. <laughs> Only paid seven ninety nine. I do have. Okay, I've got all of them. I'm not gonna lie to you. I've got every single one on their own. <laughs> and I bought the the full movie pack. So this has got what Alien Raider, Raiders, Witches Ghosts, Zombie Island, and Loch Ness Monster. I do need to find Return to Zombie Island though, so I know I'm missing that one. No, I was about to say, we did go in CEX to pick up the Tom and Jerry one. Which was in a similar box to this, four movies. And what happened, Lisa, which I'm not happy about. Apparently it's out of stock, so we went back onto the website and it actually does state that it's out of stock, but I don't, I don't understand how that happens. If it's out of stock, how did they get the case then? Where's I, the discs? I personally think that someone ordered it and they just didn't want to state it because if you look, you put it behind the counter. But I might pick it up next time in HV. I can't bother to go back now to get it. Speaking of Tom and Jerry. I forgot about that. We picked this up for 50p. Spy Quest. Never heard of original it. Original movie. And it actually says Hannah Barbera on the back. Oh my God. Happy for that one. Oops. <laughs> Not coming oh. to my And I found Dirty Dancing 2 as well in CX. Time of recording because I bought this from Nuneaton. There's only two copies left in stock. So I had to buy this one. To be honest with you, right, 
I didn't even know that you could buy that one on Blu ray. I've got it on DVD, so that's an upgrade. I didn't even know there was a Dirty Dancing 2. No, I did. Watched it before. It's not the best, but it's always good to own. Okay, talking of SpongeBob, I picked up SpongeBob SquarePants Halloween. Check out our Purge collection video if we have picked some of these up and some Scooby Doo's. Um, this is actually the only second one I own in the collection. We used to have the boxes, but we sold them because it was all damaged the outer cases. So I'm going to be collecting them. Good luck to you, Lisa. You're going to have to move your Scooby Doo's off the shelf. Oh no. Right. Just as I've organised them all about. So Lisa picked up. Um, hang on. So yeah, I'll show this one because you can talk about your Scooby. Picked up Top Cat. I don't think we've got this. You can get them in the slip. So it's £1.50. This includes a lot of episodes. I don't know if it's artwork. Oh, there is artwork on the disc. What can you go wrong? Got <laughs> Scooby Doo Curse of the Lake Monster. This is one of the new ones. Now, it's not the best movie from the live actions. I've already got it on Blu ray. But the main reason I wanted this for the collection is look at this zip cover. It's like water, like literally the underwater. You actually own that on DVD twice already. Do I? Okay, well I've just double dipped then, but it doesn't matter because it's all about that slip cover. Look at the slip. Have you ever seen anything like that? That is unique, so that's definitely going to go into the Definitely pop me on his ass. Yeah. And I've, obviously I've dressed for the part of the Scooby Doo hunting. Not me, best thing. <laughs> uh, Lisa got a Scooby Doo triple pack. Yes, yeah, she said she's not going to be double dipping. This is Scooby Doo Christmas Collection, three discs. So this is Scooby Doo Chill Out, What's Do Scooby Doo Merry Scary Holiday, and Winter Wonder Dog. Lisa says it's not double different either. Is it the? Is it because it's a variant artwork to what's in the movie box sets? Yeah. Okay. Take it of off. course, I need the full set, and maybe the full set of Hanna Barbera as well, which will never happen because there's like hundreds of series out there. Hundreds of single DVDs, just like this one, Yogi's First Christmas. I like the Flintstones one, I do. Only £1.50 for that. You know what I like about them as well? Is that Hanna-Barbera logo? Maybe I should get that tattooed or something. Don't tell me. No. I forgot a disc or no, something. No, 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 no. Oh. Okay, I picked up a DVD, I've never heard of it, called Dragon Lance. Yes, it isn't nothing to do with Warner Brothers or anything. This has got Keith Sutherland, Lucy Lawless doing the voices. But I've just opened it up and it's got a leaflet in showing you Nickelodeon oh. stuff. Which. Let me see. Shall I see the SpongeBob? Do we have any Scooby Doo's in there? Nickelodeon. Oh, that's not good, then, is it? And DreamWorks. So it's all like uh, DreamWorks, all the SpongeBobs. Good luck, Lisa. Oh, God, they're racing with the bins. Uh, Dora the Explorer. Jimmy Neutron, which I do want to read buy them again on boxes after my network. Look all the Rugrats. Oh my god. Look all the different look at all the SpongeBobs. You're gonna have to go through it like ticking them off, ain't you? The question is are you gonna buy the Leap Fox the Scooby Doo games box? Because you won't cheat for a quid stick on yourself. Probably. Well oh, I was in see it so I was looking through the HD DVD collection. Because I know that you can buy Scooby Doo on the HD DVD thingy but if you have to any hd dvds no need to and that's probably the world's biggest hd collection i've ever oh, seen yeah. any cx store i forgot to show the front cover <laughs> which one do you want to do uh we picked up some anime so we've got bad never heard of it but what can you go on for quid Watch it, see what it's like, see if there's like a whole series to this or is it just like a movie i've or... got loads of dvds with them spoilers on I'll admit I haven't watched much anime. I've got like a whole shelf, which Lisa's gonna kill me because I'm gonna take up the whole wall. <laughs> Naruto, the last story for a pound. Can you go run for a quid for Naruto? I don't want to buy the individual series or the points. I want to buy the whole complete set. Oh, and on. any day where you come back with a Lucy's DVD, it's always a good day. Are they the new ones? It looks like it. Yeah. So we've got Rabbit's one. What I like about this is the zip covers. There's loads of them. You get like different coloured ones, like orange, pink, purple, blue. You, you, this one. you might have seen them on the HMV. Did you show it on HMV? I can't remember. The, the, where there's like four or five for like 20 quid. But I want them individually. So I'm bad because it takes up the same amount of space as the box. And also, this one contains like bonus. 
cartoons as well. Here's the disc in there. Shall we have a little look? Are because you we had this trouble before Ooh. at this store. La la. La la. La la. Oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> oh, spoiler alert. If the video ain't gone live yet for the purge video, we picked up that Luna Tunes box set. <laughs> There's quite a few. We own these ones. I think one got water damage when the boiler leaked. Okay, so I'll show them this bag while you're putting it in there. There's a bag of, this is from a toy store. It's based in CX, just cross store. But it's retro something, I can't remember the whole store's name, but we picked up. Oh, hang on, here it is. Retro roadie toys. I think we promoted him once before. Yeah. So we've got a Sylvester. I need to get that wrong. Plus, it was only small. Thought it was a fan machine. <laughs> that one. Uh, it's so late in the day. So that was three pounds, but I think I like it because it's so small. So I think of that. I'm going to be first. But... Now, we've just come out of one beyond, and you would have saw that I picked off two Skibby Doo play my bills. I'm not 80% sure that I've got that one. I'll just stick that one just there, just in front of you. And then I picked this one up. So this one is um, like a jet pack or something. I think we paid two for these, didn't you? Yeah, we paid two pounds for these. You can get like quite a few of them. Are you going to unbox them? I don't know because I've already got two in the bedroom and they're still boxed. So as you would have seen in the toy shop, Michelle twisted my arm. I hate going shopping with Michelle. You spend more money than what you have to when you go shopping with well, her. Well, you know what I said? You should go for your connection. Did I say, didn't hold a gun to her head, did she I? She does. She puts a gun to your head and everything. Do you want me to take it back then? No, uh, no, no. It's not as gorgeous. Look at that thing. Have you ever seen one of these in your life? Oh, hang on. That's the stuff you want to put. I'm <laughs> So, it's a Scooby Doo Tech Robotic Scooby. So, I take it that it. Walks, barks, maybe talks. And yes. I think you use like a like an Apple iPad, iPad, sorry, or uh, Android so tablet. It says you program Tesco Scooby Doo to do what you want using an Apple or tablet, but we could use Mum's iPad or Dad's because we only some some people. You can use it, but are you going to actually use it, or are you actually just going to keep it on display? I don't know. Comment down below. What would you do? Look, look at this thing. What? Oh, it just looks nice and space. You stick it on the Power Rangers toy. Have you ever seen anything like that before? It's been, re oh, it's been resealed, but it's Scooby Doo. And one day when we have our own place, um, put some display. Or oh, Mum said you can have a glass cabinet for now in the living room. <laughs> you know. I only paid ten pound for that. As soon as I saw that in the shop, I went straight to it, and I'm surprised that it was only a tenner. So I am so happy with that. So yeah, it walks, it sits, head. Head and ears move and tail wags and it's touch sensitive as well. And the bone uh, lights up. It's a bit creepy looking. Mine's of them silver dogs when I was a kid and they bloody worked. Them animatronic. What, what are they called? Animatronic. Yeah, dogs. that's the word. Can't pronounce that word. But best purchase of the day, probably. So the question today is, what? Okay, I got two questions from me. What is your favourite Scooby Doo? It could be live action animation. And what is the one, I'd say cartoon, kids program, not if it's like puppets or whatever, is your favourite thing from your childhood that you remember? If it's from the 80s, before the 80s, 2000s, make you feel old. No, 2000s. <laughs> old timer, it's okay. Hang on, you're 30 this year, so did you? <laughs> so what is your favourite? Mine. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna say mine is gonna be Sesame no Sesame, Muppets because I I watched Muppets as a kid, but then I watched all the animations for for puppets Muppets for animations. It's gonna be Scooby Doo. Scooby Doo for me as well. No Tom, not Scooby Doo. Tom and Jerry. Cause I used to watch Tom and Jerry more than Scooby Doo. What's your two favourites in your childhood? Scooby Doo and. Probably Tom and Jerry. I only ever remember watching them play like religiously, man. Every, all the time, like 24 7. I'm stupid. I'm seeing it as a year on this. I'm guessing if we, 2000s, 90s, maybe. I don't know. If you find out, I'll stick it on the screen. 
And if you've watched this video all the way to the very end, hashtag Robotic Scooby. Or Robot Scooby. Yeah. Either one. Take your pick. So, we just want to say we hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, comment and share. Don't forget, so Carry on. Don't forget to join us on all our social media accounts. All the links are down below. So stay safe. And keep on hunting.